So my initial thoughts on the Sony 4K media player. This is the brand new model, the FMP-X10 version. Uh, this is the updated version from last year's X1 version. And this uh, supports the streaming Netflix 4K and the video unlimited by Sony 4K as well. The uh, unit itself is very sleek, uh, sharp, uh, not terribly large. Um, I really like the size of it. It does resemble quite a bit uh, of the PlayStation 4 look, um, but uh, overall it's very nice, uh, very responsive uh, in terms of the menu interface and the content of course streaming off of it uh, is very very smooth. Of course the way that this unit works is the videos are actually downloaded to the unit and so you're playing them directly off of the internal hard drive rather than streaming them uh, over your internet. So it is, it is the purest form of 4K that you can get. Uh, currently on the market and I am finding it to be very very sharp. Uh, it doesn't really do any justice for me to, to record a video of it playing on my Sony 4K TV because you're not going to see that through this video uh, as I don't have a 4K video uh, recorder yet or video camera but um, I can tell you that I'm very very impressed with the quality of image uh, that it produces obviously um, much better than trying to stream it uh, 4K video through YouTube or uh, online some other fashion. So, um, very, very impressed with it. Uh, very easy to install. Um, I, let me just show you here really quick the, the ports that are on the back. Um, pull it around here, you can see that uh, very simply just uh, it has the Ethernet port if you want to hardwire it. I've actually got it connected via Wi-Fi and it's uh, downloading quite quickly over my Wi-Fi network. Um, you can also plug in an extra hard drive here with the USB port um, and then you've got the audio video out. This is to connect directly to a TV and then you've also got a secondary HDMI for audio. This is if you wanted to send audio to uh, say a receiver or another uh, audio output other than directly to your TV. So that's kind of a nice feature to have there as well. Um, but as you can see here, it is a very nice sleek design. Of course, it gets all fingerprinted up, um, which doesn't really matter. And then in here, if you flip this down, uh, you've got the power button right there. And then on this side, actually have a USB port if you wanted to stick in a thumb drive and, you know, of course, play content directly off of your thumb drive uh, through the 4K media player. So, um, let me just show you the remote here as well. It comes with a very simple remote. Um, of course, it has some TV controls on it as well. It's a nice, very thin, sleek design, uh, much like Sony's other remotes. So, nice little remote. It did also come with an HDMI, it included HDMI cable, but like I said, I, I wanted to make sure I was using a uh, HDMI 2.0 cable, so I'm using the MediaBridge uh, HDMI cable. So, nothing much more to show you there. Um, really loving the uh, performance of it so far and uh, certainly happy to be one of the first uh, people to have the new X10 version of Sony's media player.